Hello, dear viewer, and welcome back to Monster Sanctuary with me, Jalanon, at Lunar Nebula Gaming. Today, I'm going to start combat. That's right. Starting the combat first with a sidekick buff. Yes. And then, we're going to rain the claws of doom upon them. And some arcane bolts. You know, you know, like you do. And hopefully they won't just heal. Okay, good, good. Not wasting time. I appreciate that. Let's see, claws. Let's go for the other blob. We got a crit there. Good. You can take out this one. Though, honestly, probably should let. Well, similar damage still. Maybe a difference of like 8 damage over those multiple hits. Hmm. You can take out blob with quite a few good crits. Excellent. Uh, I could give a might buff, but I think it's better to just deal damage at this point. Yeah. Yeah. I think so, anyway. Okay, leaf slash, ouch. My feelings. Okay. And now... There we are. No other new creatures yet. We do have some nice XP, though. Hmm. So let's open up the menu. It still <laughs> hurts my brain to use, like, delete or backspace to open this up, but that's okay. My brain will adjust eventually. Um, hmm. Every hit has a chance to apply chill seems pretty interesting. But we do want glory, I think. In order to get to blessing. And then... Yeah. Yeah. I think we'll go for it. And I... You know, I realize I think this unique aura might need Luna to cast the psychic buff, so... We'll, we'll see how that goes, but for now, we have what we want, and, you know, I should probably get lifesteal on Luna. Hmm. Well, for now, we switch. Okay, so, you have a skill point. Did we just make you tougher? What do we get might? Um, hmm. Because we already get might level one, but power... Oh, wait, does power do... Sorry, I think my taskbar is being a little, a little interesting. Let's see. Hand sorcery. Okay, yes, we want power. All right. <laughs> oh, screen. Why are you being interesting? Okay. So, yes, we have that. And now I think we still focus on healing with you. Yeah. For now. It's probably going to make our battles a little bit slower. Oh, Magma Flare, you gained an ability. Uh, let's go ahead and get Ignite level 2. No need to overthink it. Alright then. Man plunged into deepest abyss. Forge attacked and slew. We've read this one before. We need to find a key, I believe, in order to get to the next part. We can also fly a little bit with Vero's help. Whee. And then I need your claws. Yes, I think I need the claws. Yeah. Yeah. F. There we go. Interact. Uh, oh. Hello, new friends. All right, cat zerkers. So they are weak to earth, it looks like. Hmm. Okay. I think I'm reading that correctly. Yeah, they're good against air. Okay, well, we could do glory as a buff, but we don't need to. Let us reveal the power. Yes. That will also help our arcane bolt out a bit. Cat zerker, take this. Yes. Glorious. As you can tell, cat zerkers are... More, more interested in dealing damage. So, uh, yeah. That could be a problem for us. If we weren't so cool already. Um, and then I don't think... Do I need to do... Hmm. I think I want to do Arcane Bolt and then decide from there. Yeah, we can take out a second Cat Zerker rather than do another buff. So we will. We will. And it is glorious. Okay, more damage. More damage. Yes. Okay. Victory is assured. As we've already, you know, obtained it. Alright, no Cat Zerker, friend. I am upset. But oh well, we will come back. Obtained a walnut. That's a consumable. So if I remember correctly, you can use the food items to influence stats. As you saw there, it was defense plus eight. 
And I think you can only eat so many things. I don't know if you can... Ah! Okay, well, Catzerkers haven't come back yet. Hmm. Can I break... Looks like I need some song-based monster. Do I... Hmm. What if I summon a rock? No. Can I push the rock? I forget. I cannot. Uh, if I do this, though, I don't think they can... I can probably jump that, but... Yeah, well. Back in we go. Hmm. So we got Luna and everybody. Yeah. Okay. Okay, then. Let us stop the combat. I can't say no to more good stuff. So let's get power figured out, since that also, once again, now buffs our soul sorcery. Uh, Ice Hail. Probably better than Claws level 2. We might get a crit here. Yes. Okay. And now... I'm in a burning ring of fire. Hmm. Okay. Will Claws do more damage? Eh. Maybe we'll get a crit. We did not get a crit. We're just going to go for damage. Okay. Oh, magma. Well, let's try claws just to see. <laughs> of course it's better. Of course. I did put more into it. All right, then you. We take that. Excellent. Any new egg? No? Okay. Hmm. All right, then. What's over here? Hmm. Can I actually... It looks like I might be able to. Let's switch to you. Uh, okay. Maybe one more try? Uh, okay. I probably need a better flyer then, or... Well, I guess we'll just go over here, open this. Crit ring. Don't mind if I do. Okay. Got a vital ring, which we probably don't need nearly as much as the crit ring. Bracelet. Uh, there was something else that gave crit chance and mana region. Heather. Gauntlet, mana and crit chance, defense and attack. Um, my attack benefits significantly from the helmet, so you know what, we'll do that. Morning Star, are you still? I think it's still better. We don't need to do anything there yet. Um, probably want more mana regen on you. Mana and crit chance. We'll do that. And we'll give more health to our healer. So let's give you just higher initial stuff. Um, I probably want this over the other thing. And then we'll just give you everything else. Yeah. Okay. So there's that. What do we want to do with you guys? Skills. And we'll give you more magic. And then you. We wanted more defense. Plus, attack plus. We don't care about attack. Um, more mana. Every attack triggers an additional defense value. Spore applies weakness. Mana plus cleanse. That could be good. Hmm. Let's... Let's go towards cleanse, I guess, for now, since we can't do much else at the moment. Okay. We'll do that. And then... One more, one more time! No. All right. We tried. We tried, Vero! I'm just trying to see if maybe frame perfect... Ugh. Okay. At least, not not for me. <laughs> Moving on. Ooh, cat circuit. Okay, we might get a cat circuit from this. Yeah. Okay, uh, power or psychic? Let's do power. I think we'll have better results from that. Cat's working. Okay, that worked pretty well. Yes. The damage, it is intense, and it is powerful. Okay, uh, we do this. Almost. And that's why we have Arcane Bolt to clean. Here. Not too much damage has been taken. We continue. Until it is done. Alright. 
Hey, four stars. Okay, so... Cat Zerker. Okay, we finally have a sixth creature. Wonderful. Let's go hatch a Cat Zerker. Oh, wait, I had these. I was saving those. Yeah, I'm happy with my choice to wait. Cat Zerker, still a great name. So we're just going to keep it. Unless we could name you Clown for the giant buster sword you carry. Hmm. So it didn't reach level 5. Maybe it's one level less than our highest, or because we leveled up during the fight. Hmm. Hmm. I'm not sure. But I'm pretty happy. Do we get life steals? The real question. Yeah. Life overload, I don't think we care about unless I build HP, which I'm currently not. We can still build towards buffing as well. And then crit chance is over here. Shatter, critical freeze. This makes it sound like any ability can get chill if we crit. Huh. So I think, let's get this real fast. Maybe we'll see if that works with claws. Uh, no claws for concern. <laughs> We'll get this at level two. That'll help us with the next tree. Uh, you are already figured out for healing. We could just save the skills as well. Every attack triggers an additional hit equal to... Ooh. Sure. I don't know if that's great or not, but looks fun. So Cat Zerger is mostly a physical attacker who would basically take Luna's place at the moment. Hmm. We can get more crit chance. We can get more claws. What are you building it to? First hit of ability has a 10% increased crit chance and cannot be dodged. That seems great. Slash. Long slash. So each of these. Huh. Why? Oh, it's all enemies, that's why. Yeah. Wind affinity. Is there a one big hit move? Do you have that? It doesn't look like it. Okay. So. Fire claws, though. We can, we can go into different crit chances and stuff. Okay, okay. Well, for now, let's get. Let's see, that was. Yeah, this is still better. Critical hits apply bleed, though. Bleed's pretty good. So let's get this and. Precision. And attack plus. And I have no more skill points, never mind. Okay. Uh, anybody else? No. Okay. Then we continue with our full team! Which we will indeed move around and mix up and stuff. Keeper's Trail. But then came the four, free from greed or any other sin, who listened to the voice within, struck a wound to the realm's core. Okay. Forward! Okay. I guess I don't need to fly every time, but it is pretty fun. Yoink! Don't you wish you could have done this in Pokemon as a child? <laughs> okay, Smoke Bomb. Immediate retreat of combat. That could become useful. For now, we gather treasure! Alright. Obtained a shell. Oh, that's just defense. That's good. Uh, as you can see up to the top left there. Oh, danger! Oh, ooh, a Yali. Okay. This is a potential endgame creature based on some of the builds I've seen. So I do want a Yaoi. Yaoi provides the Powi slash it's really a tank. So, hmm, I think we go, we can select level of claws by the way, in case you did level up to level two by accident, which is kind of annoying not to use the best one every time. Okay, let's try to get a crit. Yes, okay, the extra hit that we just got the skill for. It seemed pretty good. And there's the bleed that we just saw from the cat Zerker. I believe you can make it stack even more. But that might be a skill we need to get. Um, let's take out cat Zerker. And we did get the chill. Okay, good. So that has been confirmed. Uh, I think you now deal less damage than Arcane Bolt. Maybe? A little hard to tell. Hmm. For now, we just stick him with the claws. That's right. Okay, good job, Luna and team. Wonderful. Hey, four-star Yowie egg. Okay, 
So, hmm. I might... Who would I replace for the Yaoi? Probably Magma Pillar? No, that's more of our magic. So... Might even replace Cat Zerker, because I don't think you have an ability I want to use outside of combat, do you? Let me check. Claws, Summon Rock, Slash. Breaks hidden walls, cuts through vines, which is exactly what Claws does. So yeah, Cat Zerker, as cool as you are, you are a little bit unnecessary. So, yowie. Okay, we're going to name you Chewie instead. Chewie. There we go. For our Chewbacca friend. All right, and then I think we need to actually, let's see. No, I think it is in the bottom. Ugh, if I can get to it. There it is. So if I can move you to Cat Circus position. Yes. Okay, but I think you can overload this, and then you have to return to home to your monster farm in order to get stuff done. So Yowie, I can't remember exactly which things we're going to need from you, so I'm not going to touch it for now, but I believe... Haunt is going to be a thing since we want you to be a tank. But once again, I'm not I'm not gonna not gonna touch it right now because there is a potential perfective. Yeah, we we could find. Hmm, what do I want from you, Rocky? Hmm. We were going defense on you. I think we want clearance. Yeah. Okay. All right then. Continue. Here we are. I think we're about to meet our friend. Hello, friend. Uh, books? The titles of these books read The Ancestral Tome of Blob Handling and The Hidden Places of Monster Sanctuary. A guide. Cool. I like books. Um, okay. So I think we found the farm. Yes. And I believe our first boss battle is just up ahead. Uh, can I do anything up here? Yeah. Sort of. Not quite. No. Okay. Uh, can I get on top of your house? No. Also, I guess that's rude, but yeah. Well, this isn't an old friend of mine. Hey, Burren. Long time no see. I've brought you a new student. She just hatched her first monsters. I thought you might teach her some lessons. So you're the new spectral keeper, huh? Folk call me old Burren. I've made my home at the end of the keeper's trail, so I can teach all of you green ones about your new duties as fully-fledged monster keepers. But first, let's battle to see if you are worthy of the title. All right, old Burren. Always observe your enemies carefully. Some say that the outcome of battle is decided before it begins. Since I raised those blobs myself, they are stronger than the ones you've seen so far. As you can see, their level is much higher. You can also see the weaknesses and resistances of your enemies. My blobs are weak to wind attacks. All right, we have a Vero, who is not going to actually worry too much about using wind attacks. Go figure. Here's power. Look at the top right corner of the screen. That is the combo counter. Every action you do in combat will increase the combo counter based on how often you hit your enemies, or healed or buffed your allies. This will increase the damage of the following attacks. The combo counter resets after every turn. So it makes sense to always try to act with your weaker defensive or assisting monsters first, and use high hit count actions. This will maximize the damage of your offensive monsters that act later. So, I may want to move Blob to the front so I don't constantly feel like going with Luna first, but I guess we'll do Arcane Bolt first, and then Claws based on that explanation. Ah, so close. Okay. Well, not quite enough. Hmm. I'm thinking, though, let's get Sidekick for everybody since this is a tougher battle. Claws. Hmm. I want to do this because I think if we buff Arcane Bolt, it might be enough to take out this. I am wrong. <laughs> no, I didn't want to waste Claws, but it would not have been a waste, clearly. Okay. Uh, claws is not quite enough at the moment. We're going to hope we get a crit. I am disappointed. Uh, just do this. Take you down. And then I can, I can heal you. Yeah. And I think the combo works for the heals as well, is what Burren was saying. So that should be a good heal. Yes. Let's go with this. And then 
claws. Looks like it'll take out this one. Yeah. Okay. We got the chill, even though we didn't need it. And damage. That was pretty good damage. Okay. Uh, I've still got all the buffs, I believe, that I need. Look at this. Wonderful. All right. Rare loot chance. Copper and a small potion. Okay, we did get a level up on our magma pillar. Not bad. Not bad at all. You have walked the Keeper's trail, and you defeated my monsters. However, to become a proper monster Keeper, you will need to complete one more test. Young Keeper, this next test will be much more challenging. You should prepare for it first. If your monsters have any free skill points, use them now, and use them wisely. No, but we do have some equipment I should probably put on. Hmm, yeah, I should probably put something on you. Yeah, and then I think what we're going to do is actually switch you around. Switch with Luna. Okay, so then we can start with the Blob or Vero. Yeah. We'll start with Vero first. Okay. Okay. And then we'll talk to you again. Are you prepared for the real test? Training is our cause. You show bravery, but this time you are not facing a normal monster. That's right. We face a champion, I believe, right? That's what you call I think. Particularly powerful monsters are often described as champions. They have more health, do more damage, and can act multiple times a turn. It is your job as a monster keeper to take care of them. So it's only fitting that you meet one to become a member of the Order of Monster Keepers. Show me what you are made of. Uh, flesh. Flesh. Actually, uh, let's get power. Arcane barrel. Ah, it's not great damage. Uh, air sickle looks like it could do decent. I'm gonna, I'm gonna depend on our claws, I think. We'll see. Yeah, that was good damage. Okay. Shield. Oh, that's not great. And stone ring. Hmm. Well, we get sidekick up. I think our buffs last for about five turns if they don't get removed. Hopefully. We'll do this. Ah, oh, that shield's still up. Shield's up. Okay, claws. Oh, I think it is showing me potential critical hit damage with the yellow. That was good. We got the chill as well. So if I remember correctly, chill loses 10% mana when applied. Okay, so that should mean it can't use its better abilities. Okay, well, we start off with some attacks, and then we keep hacking away at that health. Okay, claws. Yes, okay. Big old 200 damage. Ooh. Okay, well, we're doing okay on health. I'm not too worried about it at the moment. I may need to change. Okay, so now claws will do 160% damage. Almost enough for a KO, if we crit both. Okay, I think we just keep keep on keeping on. Yep. Good night, sweet golem. Alright. How we do? Ah, oh, not a five star. Oh well. We get another shell out of it though. Iron, copper, and a potion. I'll take it. Yeah, we gets a skill point, which we're not gonna touch at the moment. Congratulations, young one. You have defeated your first champion, and therefore you are now a keeper aspirant. Nothing more is required of you. However, stay a while in this because there are things going on in the sanctuary that trouble me. You see, monsters can't become this powerful by normal means, and champions usually don't accept other monsters beside them or a keeper in control of them. Champions are always an anomaly, quite rare in nature. I enhanced this golem myself to make it stronger, but even I couldn't control it for longer periods of time, so I leave it deactivated most of the time. Recently, keeper rangers have been finding an unusual amount of champions around the sanctuary, I regularly receive letters by Veromail from rangers who are stuck in the distant reaches of the sanctuary, fighting against champions. If it weren't for my old bones, I'd go out there myself. But at least I can keep the Keeper's trail safe. I trapped a champion in the caves in this area. You can take care of it if you feel up to the task. Okay, Mountain Path Key, so that's the key we needed. Okay, but before you go, there was one more lesson I want to teach you. Don't worry, I don't have any other monsters for you to fight. This lesson is just about feeding your monsters. Ooh, apples. Okay. And potatoes. Feeding you all monsters will boost their stats. 
caring for your monsters this way is vital if you intend to face more champion monsters. But a monster always only profits from the last three food items you gave to it. Okay, so that's how it works. Now, good luck on your road as a monster keeper. Now, she been unlocked the keeper's trail. Well then, you're a keeper aspirant now. Still, the only way to improve your rank is to beat more champions. And who knows, maybe you will be the one to reach the title of Keeper Master. There's always only one in a couple lifetimes. We can take care of that other champion right now, or we can go back to the Keeper's Stronghold first. The choice is yours. The choice shall be whatever's cool. Slash whatever we will run into first, because I'm lazy. Yes, okay. Moving on. I'm betting it would make more sense to find that new champion first. How'd I miss you? Ribbon, that seems pretty good. Hmm. Yes. Okay, we go this way. And I think... Yeah, I'm gonna switch to Vero. Yoink. Oh, and I can still activate Cat Zerker. Okay, good. For some reason I was thinking I could not. We didn't go this way yet. What lies upon this bridge, I wonder? As I wander. Ah, Yowies. Hello. Yowies and not Vero. Hmm. Yeah. I don't think we change anything. We could bring in Magma Pillar just because, like, uh, choose monsters. I can do Magma Pillar, Blobicus, and Luna instead. And this way, you can see Ignite! And we can go Arcane Bolt you, because why not? And then we can Claws! Yes. Okay. So, this is working. One of your number is already gone. Foolish fools of foolishness. Yes. Um, do I even need... I'm just going to Arcane Bolt this one and hope our claws can take out the yellow. Unfortunately. But we tried. So... Ignite. Yoink. And then Arcane Bolt. Glorious. So that's kind of how choosing your monsters will work. And as far as I can tell, you can select the monsters, you know, any order you want, and it has that number by their name. So there's that. Okay, and then we keep our normal formation, which is good. Let's check our skills, shall we? Do I want anything else from you, Vero, at the moment? I think not. Let's hold on to what we've got. Blobby, on the other hand. Uh, more magic. More mana. Do we need more mana on you? You seem pretty good, honestly. Hmm, we can apply armor break. You know what? That seems very good. That'll help Luna deal more damage. Do I get lifesteal? Hmm. Let's not worry about it for now. And continue. Huzzah! Alright, ah, uh, treasure. Yes. Obtained a two mana and mana region. Seems pretty good for any magic -y types that we have. Okay, I can't seem to reach up here, can I? Uh, uh. Okay, nope. Not at the moment, at any rate. Hmm. Maybe never. I'm pretty sure there's something else that goes higher than Vero does. I also don't think Vero makes us go any faster, but it's fun. So, we do that. Let's see, I think we had, what was it, down here? Oh, another thing. More money, okay. Uh, was it this way? I'm totally going the wrong way, aren't I? Cat Zerkers, hello. hello. We can also just dodge monsters. There's no reason not to do that, other than you may make them weaker by finding them too soon. Ooh, defense and magic. Uh, eh. Nope. Eh. Okay, and I need to hit a switch. I think for these, I have what I need, right? There's that one. Get it quickly in case it closes. Pandora's Box. Okay, that looks like a unique one. Defense plus 12. Receive a random buff at the start of combat. And we can get another instance of the normal. Sounds good. Okay. And then Bubble Boist, was it? Yeah, it's Blobby. All right, Blobby. There it is. Yoink. More potions. Okay. Hmm. I don't think we need to do anything with that torch there. 
Uh, I don't think... Can I do something weird with that? Like summon a rock? No. Hmm. Try one more thing. No. Okay. So I think we have to open that from the other side. Hmm. I'm going to try to jump up here one more time. Try not to get stuck. Okay. No. All right. We have tried. We have failed. That's all we need to know. Could be Chiesa, but we're going to ignore you for now. No need for violence at this point in time. Go this away. And you can kind of control your arc of jumping and stuff after you've jumped, which is pretty nice. Okay. Now there's something we can do with this later. I'm trying to remember. There's something that will let us be tiny, I think. It's been a while. Oh, let's go this way. Was it this way I need to go? Oh! No? Hmm. I was thinking it would let us do other stuff, but no. As you can see, if you basically should die, you just get punted right back to the beginning. So, we know that is a problem. We will not do that then. Hmm. I think we can switch back to Vero. Anything else we need? Hmm. I think we're pretty good. Fly, my bird. Okay. Hmm. I don't have the music note thing. At least I'm pretty sure that's what that is. Uh, was it over here? It was probably... Oh, wait. Okay. We're going to get that treasure chest. And then, uh, after I open this door, I think we may call it an episode, dear viewer. Yeah. Oh dear. We're gonna go the long way around, I see. Yep. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. <sighs> Alright. And now, let's see, I think I go like this. Okay. Obtain impact ring. Crit damage plus 20%. Okay, well, we know who to put that on. Luna. Hmm. Actually, do we have. No, we do not have a better thing for you yet. Crit chance plus 10%. We will switch you with the impact ring. So now our crit damage is also pretty insane. Magma pillar, we're not going to worry about it at the moment. You are probably fine. Yeah. We don't need crit chance on you, do we? We get the random... Let's get the random buff. Now regen and defense. We can get more defense and magic. That seems pretty good, honestly. Yeah. And then Vero. I think we're pretty happy already. Is there something better than Shell for you, though? We can go defense and attack. Let's do both. Yeah. Because you still do stuff sometimes, Vero. Okay. And then this should be Aha, yes. Here we go. So next time, dear viewer, we will explore this realm and see what lies before us. I hope you have enjoyed Monster Sanctuary. Leave a like if you did. Subscribe for more gaming videos. Comment below on what you think of the game so far. And what kind of team you think is good in the early game. For now, this is working just fine. I hope you, dear viewer, have a great day.